I'll just get one. But like when The Last of Us came out, we got we got both. I forget what they were called. <sighs> Cause they came like each one came with something I really wanted. Fuck GameStop's website doesn't have like a good description of here. UnchartedTheGame.com. Dad, I'm finished. Can okay, watch here's TV? the console. I'm already getting that. Okay, the Libertalia Collector's Edition is what we're getting. Collectible Steelbook Case. 12 inch premium Drake statue. Uncharted 4, Thieves In. I'd hope they give you the game. 48 page hardcover art book by Dark Horse. That's nice. Naughty Dog and Pirate Sigil. 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 Sticker sheet. And some multiplayer shit I don't care about. Yeah, okay. The special edition. Steelbook, 48 page hardcover, Naughty Dog, sticker sheet. It's it's exactly the same, except it doesn't have the uh, the statue. And it comes with uncharted points, in-game currency to unlock multiplayer bullshit. Okay, it's literally exactly the same, except it doesn't come with exclusive multiplayer unlocks and the statue. Okay, I, f I feel a lot better. Yes, the pandem pandemic and post-apocalyptic. Yep, that's exactly it. We got both of those. Yeah. Yeah, I feel a lot better now. Because, like, you know, Uncharted's, like, my one big game this year. And, uh, I wanted to have, like, every possible thing. But now that I know that there's no reason for me to get the special edition. There's absolutely nothing exclusive in it. Oh, here Ethan goes again with his fucking orange juice. Okay, I feel a lot better, but... If I can manage to pay off my console, um, pay off my collector's edition strategy guide, and all that shit, maybe I'll get the Art of Uncharted 4, but I don't know. Personally, I think Naughty Dog should just send it to me for being an amazing fan, you know? Alright, dinner. Do you want me to get your dinner? Oh, yeah, I'm really hungry. Okay, I'll go see what I can find. I'll Time call you when it's for ready. dinner. A peace offering. Uh, uh, that's funny. Yeah, you know, I... I was upset about the first delay because, it, you know, it was supposed to come out in March and I was excited. Um, because, you know, March was getting close or whatever. But, um, I actually wasn't upset when they delayed it from... When they delayed it to May from April. Because I knew that with this huge event we're having at work, like, April is a terrible month for me. And I wouldn't have a lot of time to play. So actually, it being May 10th is a lot better for me personally. But I was upset at first with with it not being March, but, you know, it's the... Uh, it's making the game better. It's worth it. It's worth the two-month wait. So, let's talk about the fact that he had this pizza sitting come now, Sean. Your meal is ready. in the fucking fridge on a plate. Like, not in a box. Not covered. No, wait, you know. So he takes the plate with the pizza on it and the the cold plate and throws it in the microwave and he's like all right dinner what the fuck is that and he's using a fork and knife Sean what what are you doing cardboard pizza I mean I like eating pizza with a fork and knife but I don't do it very much it's just something that like kids don't typically do Grease has Sean this weekend. Seems like he can. All right. <laughs> I 
Yeah, you know what's stupid? I don't... I don't know if you use GameStop a lot for pre-ordering or buying or anything, but... So, like... The things that you pre-order online... Aren't, like... Okay, so when you go online, you go to your account, your GameStop account... And you go to your pre-orders... So here, let me go here. Um, you're like online and your in-store are separate and it's really confusing. Like what is, what is even this one? I don't... Like we've got the Uncharted 4 Collector's Edition here. fucking weird because so you go online and it's like our online orders so it's got the Uncharted 4 collector's edition 124.99 paid off whatever but then if you look at our pre-orders on the app in the store it shows that we have a separate Uncharted 4 pre-ordered our collector's edition and that it only has like 20 bucks on it or something. Come on, like, Sean. It's time for bed. <sighs> I'm not tired yet. Can I step a little It's just longer? confusing. Now that's not very reasonable, is it? You have school tomorrow. You have to And I also sleep. don't like the fact All that like right, if, you, if you if you pre-order go brush your teeth and put on your uh, pajamas. I'll come up. If you pre-order in the store, you can you know, just put money on it whenever you want like up until the game's release, you can, you know, Okay, say so you get paid one week and you want to pit, put $50 on it, and then your next paycheck you put $100 or, or whatever you want to do. Like, you have time to pay it off. If you pre-order online, it's like, nope, you gotta pay in full. And it's just a pain. I mean, I guess it's just the logistics of, like, pre-ordering online. You have to pay it. But I prefer pre-ordering in the store because I, you know, gives me more time. Plus, if I trade shit in and they have like, you know, use your trade credit for fucking, you know, when when you like trade stuff and they give you bonus points when you're trading towards something, you know, just that kind of thing. But. Look at that knockoff Star Good Wars poster up there. My teddy! I haven't got my teddy, Dad! You must have left it somewhere in the house. Do you have any idea where it could be? No, Dad. Please. I can't sleep without him. Too bad. No, I can't do it. I can't All do right, it. Alright, I'll have a look around and see if I can find it, okay? <laughs> look at that poster. <laughs> Excuse me. I know it would have saved me time, and I'm just going to get a trophy, but I can't tell him too bad. Like, I just, I feel bad. Which is ridiculous, because I'm not even, like, really playing right now. I'm not even saving this. Oh, no, no, no. No, 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 Is that black toilet? Did that toilet paper not look black when he entered? Hold the fuck on. Go back. Black toilet paper! It's just the shadow, but it's funny. <laughs> oh my god. Oh wait. Isn't it? Isn't it over here? Yeah. Yeah, it's like you feel bad. It's like... But it doesn't... It doesn't matter. I'm not even saving this. That's like when I play Telltale games, I try to, like, have one, you know, like, legitimate playthrough, I guess, where I'm, like, giving the answers that 
I really Thanks, feel strongly Dad. about, and then I try to do another playthrough where I'm an asshole, and like, it's hard. Good night, Sean. Like, I can't be an asshole to, like, Clementine or Dad? in The Wolf Among Us, yeah. little, um, TJ. Like, I just, I can't. So sad? Why do I look I so sad? Because I'm the reason that your brother's dead. To get back to the way things were. You know, Dad, what happened to Jason wasn't your fault. Yeah, it kind of was. Good night, Sean. All right, once this shit is over, I should have this damn trophy finally. Jason's dead because he was a dumbass. And here we go with Ethan's first blackout that makes no fucking sense. Driver was like, fuck it. All right, Ethan, do your thing. See, this shit makes no sense. Okay, so he he had a freak out, he blacked out. Presumably had like an anxiety attack, whatever. And now here he is. With an origami figure in his hand. I mean, I get I don't know. They're just really trying to throw you off and make you think he's the origami killer. Whenever I talk about this game around my husband, he's like, You know the origami killer is like the dumbest thing I've ever heard of. <laughs> it's like, what a stupid name. Carnaby Corner North. And like, what does that, what does that signify? Come on, trophy. Yeah, bitch. All right. Time to see what's next. Alright, hold on. No, it's not. Like, really? You're called the origami killer? Like, how am I supposed to take that seriously? Sorry, the screen's gonna go... Gonna go blue for a minute. I just gotta check my trophy list. I wish it would let me share my trophy list with my viewers. It's kinda dumb. Alright, White Knight, I have that. I don't have Private Eye. Lead Lauren to talk about her son. Okay. This will actually take place before White Knight, even though it appears after it on the trophy list. So I need to go to the chapter called Sleazy Place. It's my next, uh... Alright, so I can go to the main menu. Trophy hype! Okay, White Knight. No, not White Knight, I have that one. Private Eye. It's a good alkaline trio song. Why does it fucking Alright. Chapters. See the place. No save. Okay. You'll need to ask certain questions of Lauren to get her to talk. Select compassionate and then trick. She'll talk about her son who's one of the victims of the origami kill. Okie dokie. Sounds easy enough to me. Oh, man. <laughs> I know my way around prostitutes. Lauren Winter. Ring any bells? Nope. Can't say it does. Oh, God. I'm so ready for this week to be over. I'm ready for this month to be over. Actually, I'm just ready for it to be May 10th, to be perfectly honest. All right. Lord Winter. Sorry, I only see clients by appointment. Wait. It's 50 bucks. I don't kiss and I don't do any weird shit. 